Hey, welcome back to another session of Korean Grammar Lesson in a Minute. And we are going to look at just and only. And the second way of doing it, okay? And this one's simpler. You just put man in front of a noun. So, super simple. Um, put noun, uh, sorry, a man after a noun, and that means it's only that noun, okay? So here's an example. Appa's dad, and you want to say only your dad, so appa man. Only dad. So for example, appa man amogosoyo. My dad, only my dad ate it, okay? You can also use it with verbs, but if you ever use it with verbs, you got to add gi to the verb. And what that does is it changes the verb into a noun. So here's an example. Kungbu hada is a verb, study. But um, if you want to add man there, you got to take away this, add gi, so it becomes kungbu hagi man hessoyo. I only studied. Okay? And usually because this becomes a noun, you got to add hada afterwards. That's my tip of the day. Okay? Let's take a look at a few more. Um, na. Plus man, na man, only me, paraba, stare only at me, look only at me. This is a favorite song uh, from like 10 years ago from by Taeyan. Um, no man, so only you, no man singing na, I only think about you. This is another song title, uh, I think from Vanilla Acoustic. Okay, think about only you. So this one's quite simple to use. And here we have the last one, nong man, it's only a joke, nong man, yeo. Okay, so man, very versatile, very simple to use. See you next time.